What's going on everyone? We are in Las Vegas at World of Concrete 2020. I'm Wayne Grayson and you're watching Equipment World where each week we bring you the latest in construction equipment, work trucks and pickup trucks. So we're here in the North Hall, the Las Vegas Convention Center and we're at the Advanced Construction Robotics booth. Here on out in this video, we're gonna refer to the company as ACR for brevity. And in today's video, we're gonna be talking about the TieBot, an autonomous rebar tying robot. Let's get into it. Now, anytime we talk about autonomy here at Equipment World, there's always a fair share of eye rolls, and that's to be expected. Autonomy is still in its infancy, and it's yet to prove to most people that it can scale to the point of delivering the self-driving cars that we're being promised in the near future. But the TieBot is a bit different. This thing isn't a prototype, and it's not a proof of concept. It's a real product that you can buy right now, and it's got two years of job site experience under its belt. In fact, the machine doesn't use BIM or any sort of plans at all. It can actually see the rebar with with computer vision just like a human would see it. It's important to note that the machine's operation is not remotely controlled. The control panel is used by what ACR calls a quality control supervisor just to get the robot situated into a starting point. But okay. once it's set and told which direction to work in, it works independently. Now ACR tells us that this robot can perform about 1,000 rebar ties per hour and can do the same amount of work that would normally take six to eight workers to accomplish. In its first two years, the TieBot has primarily been targeted at the bridge industry, but now it's ready to do any sort of horizontal rebar work. So what does this thing cost? ACR president and co-founder Jeremy Searock tells us that the machine can be leased or purchased. If you do decide to go with a purchase, it will set you back about $796,000. The good news is that most job sites only need one. Plus, because of the huge increase in productivity and the cost savings that this machine provides, CROC tells us that the typical return on investment is only one year. But ACR isn't stopping at rebar time. In 2021, the company has plans to introduce a robot that can carry and install rebar called the IronBot. CROC says that job sites that use IronBot to place the rebar and TieBot to tie it should see about a 400% increase in productivity. And that would allow you to do twice the amount of work in half the time. And as CROC notes, those are huge gains of productivity for an industry that consistently ranks near the bottom among other industries when it comes to productivity. So that's going to wrap it up on TieBot here from World of Concrete 2020 at the Advanced Construction Robotics booth. If you like this video or found the information in it useful in any kind of way, do us a favor and hit the like button below. And if you want more videos on the latest in construction equipment, work trucks and pickup trucks, hit the subscribe button below and turn on notifications so you're getting updates whenever we drop a new video. Thanks again for watching and we will see you next time.